For the first time since the Nazis took power in 1933, a rabbinical ordination takes place here at the synagogue in Cologne. The revival of the Jewish community in Germany is not only happening in big cities like Frankfurt, Munich, or Berlin. It's also happening in many small towns near Cologne, along the left and right banks of the Rhine River, a region known as the Rhineland. The Jewish religious infrastructure, which is emerging in many places in Germany, is now receiving a stable spiritual foundation from the Hildesheimer Rabbinical Seminary in Berlin. Like many other young rabbis in Germany, the four rabbis ordained in Cologne completed the studies at the Hildesheimer Seminary, founded in 1873 by Rabbi Ezreal Hildesheimer, forced to close in 1938 by the Nazis, and reopened in 2009 by the Central Council of Jews in Germany. What we want is young people whose character is outstanding and whose commitment to tradition and halakha is clear, yet who are able to express that commitment in language that is contemporary and relevant. That is what's important. In Judaism, a rabbi is a teacher of Torah, the Jewish Bible. After the completion of a grueling learning program in the codes of Jewish law or halacha, five years of training had an emphasis on 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 halacha, on knowing Jewish law, and and Talmud. That that was really the core element of the training. There's a little bit of salt and pepper that they put in with public speaking, um, counseling, and things like that. But the core was was halacha. With this ordination ceremony, the Hildesheimer Rabbinical Seminary is continuing to contribute to the revival of Jewish life in Germany through the training of young rabbis. Another historic moment. This is the first such ceremony in Rundstrasse Synagogue in over 70 years. Rundstrasse Synagogue is one of the five pre-Nazi synagogues which existed in Cologne. It was destroyed on November 9, 1938, during nationwide attacks on Jewish-owned property when Germany was under Nazi rule. The Runestrasse synagogue was rebuilt during the 1950s. The rupture exists, but we should not forget that before the rupture there was a great tradition. And if we can build on that tradition, despite the Holocaust and despite the rupture, then we have a very powerful chance of making a great statement, not only about the Jewish people, but about the future of Germany today. Present at the Cologne ordination ceremony were Dieter Graumann, president of the Central Council of Jews in Germany, and Ronald Lauder, President of the World Jewish Congress, as well as German Foreign Minister Guido Westervelle. This is my ticket to doing the professional work that I wanted to do, nothing more. Is this like a dream come true for you? It is, yeah, every day yeah, to be able to be learning Torah and teaching Torah is a dream come true. Congratulations. Thank you very much. The ordination in Cologne of four new rabbis marks the return of Jewish life to the Rhineland and it's a milestone in Jewish life in Germany and Central Europe. This is Wilson Ruiz for Jewish News One in Cologne, Germany.